Yeah. The Mac at Night Show. Twitter at Mac on the Radio. How long have you been in Miami? I've been in Miami less than 24 hours. Okay, less than 24. Yes. And what have you done in Miami? What I ordered popcorn from room service last night. <laughs> it was pretty popcorn. crazy. $20 popcorn? They, like, gave it complimentary. Oh, see? It was so nice. That's what happens like, when you're a megastar. Yeah, free popcorn. Free popcorn, popcorn. Right. damn. Uh, <laughs> but then it, like, they used, it was, like, fancy popcorn, like, with truffle sauce or whatever. Mm -hmm. And it, like, was really... Fancy sauce. Yeah, like, fancy sauce. And I was like, man, I just wanted some, like, horrible Ren and Walker popcorn. <laughs> some basic stuff. Yeah. What have you gotten for free? Like, being... I always like asking that question, because they come up with the most random things. Yeah. People got cars, clothes... <laughs> I've gotten some really cool stuff. I, I get a lot of free clothes and, like, I don't know, like, a bunch of jewelry and stuff like that. I haven't gotten a car. No. Would have been nice. Just throwing it out there. Yes, throw it out there. BMW, Porsche, anything you want. Yeah, any, yeah, like, Ferrari, no The collection. <laughs> Call us, please. Call us. Um, I know that we have a, a bunch of your fans are in here. I know they have questions for you, so we're going to get to that. Okay. One of the things I want to ask you, you follow on, uh, you follow all your fans on Twitter. Do you reply back to all of them? Do you try to? Um, I haven't started following that yet. I'm going to start following once I hit, like, 4 million. Okay, 4 million. Yes. You're at, what, like, 3, right? 3.7. 3.7, <laughs> okay. Everybody start following now. We follow. We follow. We follow. Okay, I'm Zoe, and I want to ask, like, who do you look up to? Who do I look up to? Um, I look up to I look up to a lot of people. There are people like um, Rosario Dawson and Ava Longoria, and not only are they just some of the sweetest women you'll ever meet, but they're actually doing things, um, charitable things. Like um, you know, I, I know that Eva does a lot and um, Rosario does a lot, but also um, Angelina Jolie too. Yeah. So um, I look up to people like that that use their voice and their talents for the greater good. Now i got to ask this in, in just kind of changing the, changing the topic a little bit. Were you a fan of Amy Winehouse? Yeah, Amy Winehouse. I mean, who wasn't a fan of her? Right. She was such an incredible talent that like was so fresh and so new at that, at that time. And I, d I mean, I, I knew all of her songs word for word, so. Okay. Do you, do you feel like Hollywood kind of turns a blind eye to those celebs that have issues? Because I feel like that's kind of what happened to her. Um, well, I think it was really difficult, probably, for someone like her who came out with a song called Rehab to like right. have to change her persona completely. And I think that sometimes people glamorize um, the partying and the drinking and the drugs when you when it's when you're a rock and roller or when you're in in that kind of genre of musicians. And um, you know, I think that. What people don't realize is there are some people out there in Hollywood and um, and all over the place that actually don't really li live those lifestyles, right. you know. And I think it's important. I hope it's a you know a wake up call to a lot of people um, that it, you can't live that lifestyle forever. And you know, at the end of the day, your talent is the reason why you got there. And you you really don't want to do anything to mess it up. Like I, I I surround myself with a lot of really good influences that aren't going to lead me down that path. And, um, yeah, so, and, and I, I still continue my treatment and things like that, and um, I'm really, really strong in my recovery. I make it a, da a daily priority. Do you feel like the paparazzi? Oh, yeah, hey. 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 Oh, real right. Right. Hey. Yeah. Did you ever get any privacy, like, while you were, you know, in recovery? Um... Where paparazzi like trying to scale buildings, you just get one like shot. Like treatment or recovery? Oh, oh, oh uh, treatment, treatment. Sorry, <laughs> I'm in recovery yeah, right, right, now. Recovery right now. <laughs> and you got a lot of camera phones around. You, so. <laughs> yeah. um, when I was in treatment, um, it was pretty good. Um, it was a private area, so you weren't allowed in. And when they were allowed in, I remember some of my friends that I had made it, made in treatment were like, like we're not gonna get in trouble. We'll go after them. <laughs> it was really funny. They like have my back, but um, I mean, Christmas um, I spent in treatment. And when I went to go to, like, the movies on a pass with my family, they they kind of, like, bombarded me there, which was, I mean, pretty, di like, frustrating, disappointed, cause, disappointing, because I wanted to just spend Christmas with my family. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, it's the lifestyle that I have, you know, dreamed of my entire life. Not the paparazzi part, but, you know, being in front of people singing. And, um, and so, you know, I can't complain about it because... I knew this would happen. It's just sometimes it is a bummer. Okay. 
Now, you know, speaking of music, Skyscraper, by the way, you guys love a single? Yeah. Yes. Yay! Yes. How many of you guys have checked it out on iTunes? Everybody. All of you guys? Yes. yes! What about the Spanish version? Yes. yes. Oh, very good. Yay. Could, could we get you to do it in Spanish, just a little bit? Yes. Would you be able in to do it in Spanish? Spanish. Um, well, I'm not fluent in Spanish, so I actually had like a piece of paper and a translator like next to me. <laughs> so I still have to learn does, does Spanish. Does anybody to feel know it in Spanish in here? Does anybody know it in Spanish? Yes. No. I mean, I know, I, I, I know like a little bit. A, a little bit in Spanish? Could you give us a little bit? Yeah, or? I'll do like okay. a tiny, tiny. You guys want to hear this? Yes. Yes. Okay, let's yes. do a little bit. Um, and it's like one line. Come on, rascas, yellow. See, there you go. <laughs> it's really, really hard to like memorize songs in a different language. So I still, I still have to memorize the whole thing because I just sang through it a few times. But, um, but yeah, I still got to do that. Wait till we do the Russian version. That's really <laughs> you know what? That's in the works. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of which, we got, I want to talk about some of the up and coming projects that you have, movies, shows, all that stuff, and focus more on the music as well. And I know other fans here. We're gonna give them a crack at the mic. Coming up, Demi Lovato in studio. Hang out. It's Y100. Yeah. The Mac at Night Show. Twitter at Mac on the Radio.